Hi, beautiful people welcome to our developer's diary YouTube channel. Today we shall learn how to use the simple form SOP UE5 web component and create login page. In the previous videos we have set up Visual Studio for SOP UE5 development. Playlist link is in description. Kindly subscribe to our channel so that you can get amazing and informative videos. Go to command palette, select open application generator. Select the application type. SOP UE5 freestyle. Choose SOP UE5 application. Choose data source as none. Mention the view name. Enter project attributes, then press finish. It will take some time. After installation of dependencies you will be able to develop your application. Navigate to new created project. Before development, let's discuss Bootstrap Grid System. This system allows 12 column across the page. Each column contain one span. Also if you don't want to use individual columns, you can group them into one or as per your need to create wider columns. Also, screen resolution affects the grid system. Resolution greater than 1200 pixels consider as extra large. Similarly resolution greater than 992 pixels and less than 1200 pixels consider as larger and so on. Now, let's develop simple login page using SAP UE5 simple form web component. Add simple form tab. Let's set its attributes. Mention ID. Set edit table true, otherwise input fields will show in readable mode. Set layout, set label span for large screen. Resolution of my system is more than 992 pixels. I am combining the four column for label span. It covers the space left side of label. Mention empty span large for to cover the right side of field. Mention column large as one to get the complete left to right width. Set adjust label span false so that label did not set itself automatically and depend upon the layout. Mention title. Add form content tab. Add labels and fields, first for username, second for password.
Let's create footer. Add bar tag in footer. We want to set out content to write so use content write tab. Add a button. Mention your custom function name at press attribute. Here function name is on login press. Let's run you app in debug mode. Page is showing with simple form, but empty span is not covering its right side space. Issue is layout name. Grid word is missing. Now form is showing as per our desire. Let's change the browser size for checking responsiveness. It's totally responsive. Let's define our function in controller. Get values of username and password. First we shall get the view then its attributes by their ID. Then get the value of that attributes. Let's import message toast namespace. By using show function of message toast, we shall exhibit our username and password.
Enter username and password, then press login button. Message toast is showing values. Let's add a condition for showing message toast. Let's change the application title and form title. So we have used simple form UE5 component in this video tutorial.